Man, Grit Week's really got me down. Wish I had something to wipe my butt with. Dude wipes. The number one wipe for dudes. If you're still wiping your butt with toilet paper, you're a chump, straight up. Dude wipes, use them instead of toilet paper or you use them as the last thing with toilet paper, you never felt more clean. It's like getting out of the shower after every time you have to take a little number two. Dude wipes, do it, I swear by it, I use it as well. The only problem with dude wipes, they don't give me a full body shower. For grit week, I needed something that was a little bit better. A full body shower, I wish dude products would come out with that. Oh my God, they did. Dude shower. Recently released, dude shower is a full shower on the go. If you're the Indy 500, you haven't taken a shower all week like me, boom, shower. If you're a guy who sweats, maybe your lunch break in the middle of summer, boom, shower. If you're a guy who just kind of smells like crap and doesn't feel like taking showers, a little bit of a weirdo, boom, shower. Dude shower, only way to go. Here's what I'm gonna do for you, dudeproducts.com. Put in the promo code GRITWEEK, 15% off everything. That's promo code GRITWEEK, 15% off everything. Get yourself clean, dude shower, dude wipes, do it. To you, what does grit mean? Well, you know, if you think about uh, how this area was founded, settled, if you will, is so many immigrants came over and worked in the grittiest jobs, you know, the steel mills and the rubber factories and the glass factories and, and all of those things. And, and they were going to have to be gritty, you know, to survive the heat. You, you should stop by the Labor Museum, which is right on the edge of campus here, and, okay. and, and, look, at, and look at the furnaces and, and look at what those men had to do every day. Well, that became a part of who they better be or they weren't going to survive. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, it became a part of their family is that, you know, the wife or the kids or whomever weren't going to bellyache about what they had to do when they saw... You know, their dad come back from those steel mills and, you know, mm -hmm. seared and sooty and, and all the rest. They were going to develop some grit of their own. And, and I think when those people came to this part of the country and, and this became their community, all of a sudden everything about the community became gritty. Their high school football was gritty because, mm -hmm. you know, they weren't going home for the weekend. Right. They weren't going back to Europe for the weekend. Or right. They weren't going back to wherever for the weekend their community became their seven day a week thing and so every part of the community uh, the competitiveness the card games downtown uh, you know whatever it happened to be everything in this region was gritty and if you weren't if you didn't have grit you weren't going to survive and so i think it's in their dna One take bow, that's it. <laughs> Nailed it. We are in Newport, Kentucky. Uh, stop for Cincinnati, right across the road from Cincinnati. We are, this is the end of stop four. Buffalo, Cleveland, Pittsburgh, Cincinnati. We're now off to Indianapolis for the Indianapolis 500. So we've been on the grit tour for five days. It feels like five million and we still have the like two huge party days coming up so wheels down let's do it 
wheels up. No, wheels down. No, it's wheels up. Yeah, but we're not flying. We're on. We're on it's a, still wheels up. Still yeah, wheels but up. the bus is on. Have the Have you ever been on a business trip before? It's always wheels up. But if the bus's wheels are up, wouldn't you say we're in trouble? Yeah, but it's it's the whole principle of like we're when you're flying. Wheels up. I know what I said. What you said was wrong. It's wheels up. It's wheels up. Wheels down. Boston has their beans. Georgia collard greens. New York's got her pizza pie and Cincinnati's famous for her skyline Skyline chili's the reason why Just get everything, let's get everything and just put it on the table and we'll eat it I'll order, let me order, I got it Hey guys, I got this Can we get some extra crackers? A big cracker Thank you, that yeah, may be can really, really satisfy my soul. There's one, two, three, four, five ways to heaven. It's pure aromatherapy. And you must have plenty of Erster crackers to complete the meat water symphony. Cut it with a fork. If you twirl it, you're a dork. It's sweet and spicy, goodness can't be beat. Cincinnati's famous skyline is the only skyline you can eat. I don't understand how people eat this for like a casual lunch and go back to the office. <laughs> yeah. That's so, the craziest thing I've ever heard. We're what? getting on a bus, so it's not exactly, we're not exactly doing it right. But where else can you get a hot dog with mustard and chili on it? No like way. Just you, Cincinnati. Like when in Cincinnati, yeah, 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 when in Rome, you gotta stop in, you gotta do as the locals do. Blend in. I think we've done that. Get a, get a hot sauce cracker going on the way out. One for the road. <laughs> there it is, that's his magic right there. <laughs> Cincinnati magic. Cincinnati <laughs> magic. <laughs> oh. I don't think this is glee. You just squirted. Hey, come here, your nose. This episode of Part of My Take is sponsored by diarrhea. <laughs> It's gonna come. <laughs> it's it's coming. We have a two-hour drive to Indy. We're probably gonna take three stops. Diarrhea when you can't when you eat chili and you can't have a regular shit. <laughs> what do you get? To it's, get it's your very own minutes. diarrhea. Go to Skyline Chili <laughs> forward slash Barstool backslash Grit Week. <laughs> Try it out for yourself. Your idea. All right. Not my idea. Yeah. All right. We're in the Indy Indianapolis 500. Uh, Stop! <laughs> milk Mile. Winner of the Indianapolis 500 drinks milk, pours himself milk. We are all drinking a half gallon of milk and running a quarter mile around this beautiful uh, fountain. And we'll see how it goes. Guys that like milk. Fucking got on me, Hank.
って。myself into something fancy like a nice Coors Light. <laughs> Look how sad these are. Like, where are you? You're in the wrong spot, guys. You just throw these, like, four ounce cookies <laughs> in the corner. What the hell? Like, what are these? None of these things are real. No. Suave creamies? Okay. Concito. These aren't American, are no, they? No, no, these are definitely yeah, some Mexican. kind of Hispanic knockoff. All right. I just, I'm a guy who likes to wear a hat, but I don't like to promote for anyone else. Don't wear my hat. Good work, guys. Keep it up. Foreman on duty. See, Dan likes to pretend like he's making jokes in the video, but he gives him a good pretext. Hey, it's to just, content, dude. It's content. I mean, these goldfish, goldfish is content, okay? I don't even want them. I'm gonna go jerk off in the bathroom as content. I'm gonna drug. We just see the band movie. <laughs> <laughs> Just give a sweet bottom of me, J. Owen, okay? <laughs> See you later. <laughs>